this is Lucia. I have been running Eon Studio, a Web3 creative studio, since 2021. Our studio explores the artistic value of works created at the intersection of technology and art. Until now, Eon Studio has collaborated with approximately 300 domestic and international artists. We are leading the way in creating and promoting a new ecosystem where art and blockchain intersect, known as crypto art. While crypto art is often misunderstood as being solely linked to the crypto investment market, we are redefining its true meaning through the upcoming curator economy. Currently, we are planning various exhibitions to highlight the true value of crypto art. Especially, we are promoting crypto art by hosting the Crypto Art Soul event annually. The upcoming East Asia Generative Art Exhibition is a project led by Nerd Gallery in Japan. In Korea, artist Seo Hyo Jung and Eon Studio have been invited to collaborate and co-organize this exhibition. When I first heard about this exhibition from Nino Misang, I was very excited and intrigued, and I was curious to see the trend that would emerge when generative artworks from not only Korea, but across East Asia were brought together. And I was particularly interested in how the unique cultural background and technological advancement of Asian countries would be reflected in the artworks. In Korea, there is a noticeable lack of specific discourse on works created through programming within the broader categories of media art or digital art. Many artists are doing innovative and fascinating works, but there seem to be a little lack of platforms to systematically discuss and develop these works. So the main goal of this exhibition is to bring together active generative artists to share and discuss their work. When collaborating with artist Seo Hyo Jung to select artists for this exhibition, we believed it was important to include a range of generations from master level artists who has been active in the field of media art for a long time to young artists who have recently mastered new creative technologies and entered the path of artistic creation. Our aim is to show that the generative art scene in Korea has moved beyond its nascent stage and reached a mature phase. And at the same time, we wanted to convey the vibrancy brought by the continuous influx of young artists. Um, I hope this exhibition demonstrates that Korean generative art is not just a newly born genre, but one where mature artists are already creating deeply resonant works. We also want to highlight that young artists are constantly emerging and bringing new energy to the scene. In Korea, generative art and digital art are gradually gaining attention, but I believe they are still in their early stages. Although there is a growing lineage, the field of generative art has yet to be clearly defined. This is why I consider this exhibition to be particularly valuable. It can be seen as a new challenge and a first attempt. In Seoul, many artists are experimenting with new technologies in their creations, but the process of systematically organizing and developing this effort is a little bit slow. So I hope this exhibition will accelerate this trend, allowing more people to understand and enjoy generative art. Thank you.